We have a little mm-hmm. video here. I've been to shows. Port Arthur. You've been to mm-hmm. Port Arthur, then you know what it looks like. Uh, this is the Motiva oil refinery. It is the biggest in the world, or at least in North America. Mm-hmm. It is in Port Arthur, but it's owned by a Saudi Arabian company that made more profit, twice as much profit as Apple computers mm-hmm. last year. Mm-hmm. Although right next door, I met a family in a $60,000 house that can't afford to fix the mold from Harvey. Uh, even though they understand the problems, they would tell you, please don't shut them down because I will die of starvation before I die of pollution. They're worried about jobs. And so what do you tell the pipe fitters and the cafeteria workers in Port Arthur? What will happen to them if these places go dark? So I would say two things to them. The first one is that's not the only job in Port Arthur over the next 20 years. I've seen Port Arthur. Port Arthur is going to need a lot of infrastructure rebuilding and strengthening. It's going to need a lot of help right on the water. Those are good jobs. Those are union jobs. Those are skilled jobs. We have a lot of work to do, and I hope the workers in Port Arthur will be a big part of that. That's part one. But part two is who's making the real money? 